The part shown is made of steel. Using Castigliano's theorem, what is the deflection of point D in the Y direction? This is the third example for the Castigliano's theorem main video, link below. So make sure to watch that one and the first two examples before watching this. The deflection at point D in the Y direction will be the partial derivative of the strain energy with respect to a force that goes in the Y direction, which in this case is the force of 1200 pounds, so we'll call that F. As always, starting from the point of deflection, we see that the internal strain energy of member DB is that, due to bending, caused by the moment about the x-axis. The moment would be equal to F times Z and the partial with respect to F, only Z. The strain energy inside member BC will only affect the displacement of C with respect to B, which has nothing to do with the displacement of D. Therefore, we don't take into account the strain energy between B and C. With the free body diagram of member AB, we see that there's strain energy due to the torsion of torque T, which doesn't vary along the x-axis, and strain energy due to bending about the z-axis that does vary along the x-axis. Substituting these values, carrying out the integrals, and finding the values for E, I, J, and G, we find that the deflection is 0.0156 inches. This is the deflection of D in the direction of the force F, which is the same as the deflection of D in the y-axis. If we wanted to calculate the deflection in any other direction, we would use fictitious forces in the x or z axis. Thanks for watching.